In this video, I'm going to show you how to use components to style your Mapbox map in Mapbox Studio. We're going to create a map like this that really emphasizes the ferry routes leaving the piers here. We're going to start in Mapbox Studio, click New Style, Streets, and Customize. And now in our new map style, let's do a couple of things with components to declutter our map. So the first thing we can see is that we have components visible here, and we also have all of the layers that go into building this map style. And components are just uh, intuitive groups of these layers. So I could click on land and water, and here on this land use toggle, it looks like I can just turn off all the green. So if I'm building a map that's really focused on these ferry routes, it's a nice thing. It helps keep the viewer focused. And next I'm going to take these orange highways, and I'm not really interested in highways, so I'm going to mute the color to this much lighter gray. And now the highways are still visible, but they're much less featured. And lastly, I'm going to click on this road network component, and I have a number of options here. I'm going to use this toggle switch to turn off the highway shields. So now we have a map that's much more focused on the ferry routes, and they're a really light color though, so what can we do to change their uh, style? I'm clicking on one of them, and under components I can see we've got land and water and transit, and of course ferries are a transit element. So in the transit component I can see a number of features, but the only thing I see for ferries is a toggle on off switch. So the component is probably not going to offer me enough access. I'm going to click on Layers, and I can see that right here where I clicked, I can access this line layer to control the styling of the ferry routes. So here in the Layers view, I have this color, and that's what I'd like to change. But Studio is telling me that color is actually set by the component, and do I want to override? I do. Now here, I have complete control of the color, and I don't need two different uh, colors in my style, I'm much more simple. So I'm just going to go with this dark blue, and there I can see it changed. And now I can also see that if I wanted to revert, I can bring back the original style. I'm going to choose to override and repeat my last change to this dark blue. And the other changes I'd like to make to this line are to the width, which I'd like to set at just one value, three. I can see that the dash array is now a little bit awkward, so now I'm going to change that to two and one at both of these zoom stops. And that's much more what I'd like to see. So now the last thing I'm going to do is take this uh, POI label and just hide that keep my map nice and focused on those ferry routes. So that's it. That's how to use components to style your map, how to override one of those components to style a layer individually, and also to use the revert option when it's available. I hope you enjoyed this and keep building.